Good morning, friends. It is time for today's daily spirit lift, spirit lift number five of the virtual spiritual handbook. And uh, today we are going to be talking about retraining your brain. Uh, our brains are very efficient, which is a good thing. Um, for example, uh, I have sat in this chair hundreds and hundreds of times, and I uh, probably the first time I sat in it, I might have noticed the texture on the arms. It's got a little bit of a, a rippled texture, probably for grip. Um, but uh, every time I sit in the chair, I don't notice that. Um, it's something that has sort of faded into the background, and uh, that's how our brains work. Uh, if you, you you wouldn't possibly want to notice everything. Uh, that you possibly could. Uh, the, the texture of the chair, the light coming in through the window, the uh, pressure of your feet on the floor, so on and so forth. You'd be overwhelmed by uh, feelings and emotions and understandings and sense. The problem with that is that um, if you experience something many times, you can create a problem with your brain. Uh, Problem maybe isn't the right term, but you can create an issue. So uh, if you had a, a bad experience once with a particular kind of food, you may not want to eat that food again. If you have experienced a, a, a childhood um, dog bite, you may have a fear of dogs, which you can understand uh, where that comes from, but uh, not every dog is going to be dangerous to you. Um, it may keep you from getting a pet, but you may really want to have a dog. And uh, uh, but you may be afraid to do so. Um, so our brains, they sort of create these paths and uh, they get uh, efficient or uh, I've used the term lazy, but I know some people don't like that term uh, when I use it, uh, that your brain gets lazy. Um, but I think it's kind of funny. So anyway, it works the other way too. If you spend time thinking about positive things, Thanksgiving, you can retrain your brain to grow neurons. Uh, we didn't think that, that uh, years ago, we didn't think that your brain could regrow stuff. Uh, we thought that that stopped when you were a teenager. Um, but uh, we have since found out that uh, it's called neuroplasticity, that your brain can regrow um, uh, routes for you to experience new things, for you to, uh, ju just the same way negative things can happen, so can positive things. So spending uh, five minutes in silence a day retrains your brain to uh, appreciate silence. Spending time with Thanksgiving actually does retrain your brain to uh, be thankful. Same thing with, with exercise. That's why uh, exercise is uh, so important to have uh, sort of a, a schedule for it, because that can retrain your brain to um, get you out and about. So uh, um, so today I encourage you, uh, we talked about how uh, spirituality is mind, body, soul, spirit, the whole thing, uh, brains as well. Um, retrain your brain. Think of some positive things that you want to do, whether it's uh, whether it's spending time at the end of every day taking stock whether it's two minutes, minimum of two minutes a day uh, in silence to spend with God when you first get up in the morning, whether it's uh, appreciating your partner more, telling them uh, how much you love them and care for them, whether it's appreciating your children more. Uh, if, if every time you're looking at your kids and you're thinking, oh, gee, I, you know, I wouldn't do things that way, you can get extra critical before you even know it. Uh, and then every time you experience uh, your child's um, presence, you can be uh, be extra hypercritical. Um, now, the good news is this works both ways. Reading the Bible, spirituality, all those things, you can retrain your brain to, uh, to accept and, and uh, receive those things. All right, that's today's Spirit Lift. I hope you're doing well. Uh, keep up with the Spiritual Handbook. Um, we're going to be uh, moving on to some new topics shortly, and uh, I hope that you're, uh, you're going to find these uh, informative and useful. All right. Blessings to you. Uh, mask up. Be safe. Uh, miss you all. Love you all. Talk to you soon. Bye.